what's up guys it's risky here welcome back to some more called wild in this video i'm going to be showing you how i typically set up my maps when i am uh, just out hunting and grinding and just want to shoot a lot of animals very quickly this is pretty much how i set up every other map uh, i'm going to be showing the example on rancho here today because this is the new map this is what most people are typically playing right now uh and i still am on the new account obviously this is my only account really i reset my other one we're level eight we do have a skill point let's use that really quick we're going to go ahead and throw that into the level two for track knowledge Re reveals information about approximate animal size group size when investigating need zone tracks and animals approximate health okay yeah that's cool that's cool we'll take that i guess might as well so the first thing we're going to need today is some tents i only have enough space to really carry one i'm too broke to afford them so we have one we have a couple extra here that they already give us but we're going to be starting off with one tent which is completely fine we're here at this spot and typically what i do say i want to hunt whitetail the whitetail zone is from 8 to 11 30 and, and you can see i have them on these points of the lake and i'm sure there's a few around here but that's okay now we want to go ahead and put ourselves a tent around here somewhere we'll find a good spot that's going to allow us to just get there a lot faster and save us a lot of time traveling so first step let's go find us a good spot to put this thing that's not too close to a need zone but also not too far away All right, so i think i'm going to put my first tent somewhere around here i'm going to put more on this lake just to get around it faster obviously and it's quite a large lake you can see it's a good ways to get to the other side and i had that whitetail drinks in right here we did spot a doe there but they're right here and we have this nice perfect hill to the right of this zone up here on the east side so we're going to get up on this hill place a tent and then i'll show you what we do from there you also want to make sure you're not too close to the zone because if you do spawn in too close it will cause the animals to spook i think we'll go ahead and set our tent up right around here if we can yep just like that all right now we got that first tent out of the way what I'm going to do now, we need one of these bad boys, a tripod stand. We'll just use the Arctic one for now. Uh, and by the way, it is best to use all of the same tents, all of the same tripod stands, whatever. You know, it's good to use just the same kind instead of a bunch of different kinds. And what I mean by kind is the color. Just because, you know, it's easier just to pick them up. Instead of having four different kinds on you, you're going to have to have four different slots for the different colors of tents, if that makes any sense. You can already see from here... Boom, we got a beautiful view of some whitetail down there. We don't want to shoot them yet, though, because if we shoot them like this, we're just going to create too much unnecessary hunting pressure. Let's take out this tripod stand, and let's find us a nice, stable spot to put it, like right here, I think. Boom. Yeah, we got that all set up. It's going to give us a perfect view down there on all those whitetail. Nice, couple nice bucks down there. A couple decent ones, anyways. Let's try and knock that one down. That one maybe even drop one more oh that's a pretty decent buck i think we'll let him go this time i think we actually just dropped him there so we won't let him go this time <laughs> see i shot if i would have shot all those deer without being in that tripod stand that area would have been much darker with that hunting pressure which is not good oh yeah look at all these deer right here beautiful nice drop shot there this is that one that almost got away from and where do we hit him at oh we smoked him with a double lung there from 230 out and here's the first one where we get him yep double long shot again and 220 well we're done hunting on this side of the lake oh there's actually even more white tail over there that's good a lot of white tail plenty of money and xp for me to grab I'm done over here now i need to get the heck over there but the problem is i don't have a tin over there let's go set one up okay we're at my second spot um i just shot a few white tail by the way that's why it's already purple i, I should have showed you guys that but i got two ahead of myself but we're at the next spot i'm not gonna be putting the tent here but one thing i am gonna do grab a another tripod really quick bring this and i'll show you where i'm at this is an amazing spot for whitetail always come here you can see the hunting pressure is amazing uh well it's not amazing but it's very bright which means i've killed a lot of animals this little cove right here in uh, caros del espinanzo whatever that says bosque alto come to this lake come up here to this little cove it's amazing we're gonna set ourselves up a tripod stand right here and then we're gonna grab the tent again and go further that way let's actually face the ladder to us that's a good idea that way we can just walk into it boom hop up in there and you can see we have this cove that we can look into there's normally deer all around here deer sitting over there sometimes very good spot for a tripod stand when it comes to shooting whitetail sometimes you can even see them sitting over there we'll grab our tin again and we're gonna head this way and just get away from these need zones just like we did with the other spot yeah i think this is a good spot for our next tent somewhere in this flat spot maybe it'll let me there we go just like that right next to the watchtower we can spawn here 
run over the hill a little bit, about 160 meters, hop in our thing and shoot some whitetail. It's that easy. At some point, I might put another one over here. I still need to do the same thing to like this lake, this lake, this lake. There's a lot of work left to do here ever since I reset my character. I got a lot of work left ahead of me. I don't really regret. I'm, I'm down to do it. I haven't done it in a while. I did it a long time ago on my old character. It's not that hard to do. It's just very time consuming. But hopefully you guys did enjoy that video. Just a pretty quick one. Just showing you guys how I set up my maps for hunting, whatever it might be. Uh, you don't have to set it up like this just for whitetail. I set it up like this for pretty much whatever I'm hunting, whether it be mule deer, kudu, zebras, giraffe, I don't care. Same thing. But hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully you learned something. If you did, let me know in the comments section and also by smashing that like button. And if you're new here, subscribe. It always helps me out. Yeah, see you guys in the next one. Later.